I, I mean, I love a little family, but I think we're going to have to change our ways, Edie. Cannibal and family. It's a kind of anomaly. <laughs> I mean, we cannot be barbarian. We really should become vegetarian. Are you serious? Uh, you bet. <laughs> You're the one who's making me feel like I'm 33. I don't need no barbecue, cause I've got you. I've got you. No more sailors, no more Sue. No more depopulating shipwrecks with you. But don't you want to raise a kid or two? Oh, yes, my love, I really do. Well, then listen to me now. Do you want our Annabelle growing up a cannibal? And of course we're gonna have to get some kind of family pet A dog, a cat, a marmoset Oh, marmoset! They are delicious! <laughs> no, 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 it's not okay Do you see the danger in a future that way? Suppose our kitty cannibals start off by eating animals Then graduate to eating meaty, matey sailors too They might eat you no! Or me so, let's go vegetarian. It's time we became agrarian and stopped being so barbarian. Who's barbarian? We are, but now we need to guarantee that members of our family don't end up in a recipe. Don't be contrarian, go vegetarian. Not even a little hot dog. They're not even really meat, are they? Frisky, oh, yes, indeed. A little roadkill now and then? I don't need no carry on, because we're vegetarian. But it's free! No, no, no. Soon we're marrying. Marrying! We'll want to raise some kids. Oh, yay, yeah, kids! Who won't shove us in pots and slam the lids. God forbid! We can have a 